Welcome to Intro to VOIPs by the Mary F. English Program at Northern Illinois University. VOIP stands for Voice Over Internet Protocol, or in other words, our Internet Telephone Services. In this video, I'll introduce you to today's leading VOIPs, Skype, Google Hangout, Google Voice, FaceTime, and Uvu. All you need to use these services is a webcam and a microphone. Most laptops today come with both built in, so you can begin using any of these VOIPs right away. If your computer does not have a webcam, you can buy one on Amazon for as little as $20, and if you need a microphone, you can buy a headset with a microphone for as little as $10. Skype is the world's most popular VOIP with over 350 million users. Skype lets you video chat with one other Skype user at a time for free and allows you to make conference calls with up to 25 people at the same time, as long as at least one person in the conference call is paying for a premium Skype account. You can also use Skype to call standard phone numbers, but for a fee. Skype works on both computer and mobile devices, offers free screen sharing, and has a built-in instant messenger. Google Hangout works similarly to Skype, except Google Hangout lets up to 10 people video conference call at the same time for free. In order to chat, all Hangout members must have a Google Plus profile, which you can get for free by signing up for a Gmail account. If you live in the United States or Canada, you can call US or Canada phone numbers and have them join your Hangout for free. Hangout only works on computers and does not have a mobile version. You can share your screen using Google Hangout, collaborate with people on Google Drive documents, and Hangout offers a feature called On Air that allows you to automatically record and post your chat to YouTube. Another service that Google offers that is different than Hangout is Google Voice. If you live in the United States, Google Voice will let you make free phone calls to all phone numbers in the United States and even give you your own phone number so you can receive calls from America for free. Once you create a number, you can have any calls made to it forwarded to your mobile or landline for free. Google Voice also offers free text messaging and will take voicemails for you and transcribe them so you can read them as text in your Gmail inbox. FaceTime lets you call one other FaceTime user at a time for free anywhere in the world. FaceTime is very easy to use and has computer and mobile versions. While the app is called FaceTime on Macs, iPads, and iPods, FaceTime can be found within the phone app on iPhones. The major limitation of FaceTime is that it will only work with Apple products, so you won't be able to call someone who is using Windows or an Android mobile phone. Although FaceTime comes for free on most iOS mobile devices, on Mac you have to buy it for 99 cents in the Apple Store. And the last VOIP we'll be introducing is Uvu. Uvu is a popular VOIP by Verizon with 35 million users. It lets you video chat with up to 11 other Uvu users for free at the same time. Uvu runs on both computer and mobile systems, integrates well with your Facebook chat and friends list, but asks for you and your friends Facebook data in the process, lets you send up to 5 minute video messages to someone's email, and offers a YouTube viewing party system where you can watch YouTube videos live with up to 11 other people. Uvu will let you call phone numbers in a few countries before a fee, and you'll have to buy a premium subscription if you want to use screen sharing and remove advertisements. Thanks for watching this introduction. Please continue on to the individual VOIP tutorial videos for guided walkthroughs of each platform.